Whoa! Here we go. It worked. A little oh, messy. So nasty, but it worked. Ready? <laughs> Ready. All right, so today's project or extension to the project is a little pilot bearing removal trick. So we got a pilot bearing. This one's fine. You know, stick your finger in there, and rotate it around. It don't feel all loosey goosey or anything. So they make pilot bearing removal tools that you can buy and use. And we probably have one here, but this is a pretty, pretty cool field trick. So what you need, you need to get you a socket that fits in the hole as well as you can find. Now this one's a little loose, so I'm gonna try wrapping a little piece of uh, electrical tape around the end. Everything's cold today, so it probably won't stick very well, but. And I gave you the crappiest electrical tape we have. Yeah. Because they're trying to use it up. This is the stuff Harbor Freight threw away. Yeah, they might as well. <laughs> All right, so we got that. That's gonna fit in there a little tighter. That feels perfect. Um, take your extension, stick it on the inside of the socket like this. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna pump grease in here and we're gonna hammer on it like that and creates a little hydraulic ram effect. So we got the grease packed in there. And what this is gonna do that, that, we're using this as an extension, but we're actually plugging that hole in the bottom of it with it. Now sometimes some sockets, they don't have a round hole in there, they got a square one on the back and that's a little easier to use. Mm -hmm. But this will work fine. So just stick it in there like that. Get my hand out of the way. So you hammer it, you pull it out. And we just shoot more grease in there. Yeah, you just keep doing this process over and over and hopefully it works. Now, I've always had this thing work. Sometimes I've had to, uh, come on grease. It's cold so the grease doesn't wanna. Nothing wants to work, including me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be the greatest thing ever if I had a lathe. I'd use it for everything. I have a job that requires a lathe. Better Mickey Mouse some sockets <laughs> together. <laughs> I think we're actually out of grease. Yeah, I was, I was gonna suggest that, but I was gonna let you screw with it for a few minutes more. This is the part where we find out we're not out of grease, it just explodes everywhere. Ah! Yeah, man, that means I pumped like almost that full tube into the axles on that dump trailer when I brought it home. <laughs> cool. Cool story, bro. Cool story, bro. Yeah, we found out the grease gun works better when there's actually grease in it. Sometimes. Chinese crap. <laughs> oh, it just moved. Wow. It's like you can't get it back off of you once it gets on you. Whoa. It's working. I can tell you that this, uh, uh, a lot of times, especially on 18 wheelers, that inside diameter is the exact diameter of a broomstick handle. Really? Yeah, I had an instructor at uh, when I was at UTI tell me this trick. I thought he's full of crap. He's like, yeah, you just pack it with the grease, get a broomstick handle, and smash it on in there, and it'll pop it right out. I was like, I ain't never gonna do that. And then one day I was like, yeah, I wonder if that really works. So I tried it, and said, voila! Cool. It's one grease trick the cops don't want you to know. <laughs> oh, that's great. So close. Dude, it's like all cattywampus. I bet you can rip it out now. Well, this is the power of high hydraulics, even in what I can only conclude is an extremely inefficient uh, application and method. It's still the power of hydraulics. Yeah, I mean, it, you know, like I said, if you're in the field. Dude, that's friggin' press fit. You probably knew this, but I'm looking at all the markings on it from where they pressed it in. Yeah. A lot of these, see, you know, little tips like this, nobody's ever heard of. So yeah. that's kind of the point is like, you know, Chucky and I try to like, hey, this is something we picked up along the way. Maybe it works for you. Maybe you hate the idea completely. But now you know, and you can fall back on it if you yeah, ever have I mean, If to. you're in a pinch, you're like, you know, I saw that YouTube video. That guy did that. I wonder if this will work this time. And it works. Whoa. There we go. It worked. A little oh, messy. So nasty. But it worked. Appreciate hey. it. Hit the like button, comment. and Get it so nasty. Thanks for get watching. Get out and fix something.